Okay, what's up guys? So uh, KSI has uploaded a video called I Am A Coon. Now, uh, if you don't know what like a coon is, coon is a derogatory name towards black people. I've, I've been called that plenty of times by, <laughs> by the YouTuber Minnesota Boy and his fans and stuff. So uh, yeah, I, I, I can say I'm familiar. I'm very, very familiar with that name. But uh, I would like to see what this video is about. Let's let's see what goes down. Hey guys, what is Alex GWT? How are we all doing? Now this happened a week or two ago, but I want to address it today. So a few weeks back, I was enjoying my day, eating some egg, which I found out is actually chicken period. What? Anyway, I was what? on Twitter, and for some odd reason, there was just a bunch of people calling me a coon. KSI Dang. is such a coon. Dang. KSI is a coon. KSI is actually wow. a F-K-I-N coon. KSI is such a fucking coon. Wait, this guy's not even black. What the fuck? <laughs> Check out the definition of the word coon. Check out the definition. Said it was short for a coon. So I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> I want a Google image to actually see if I look like a raccoon. Uh, I, I don't know. I, I don't think so. I mean, they got like a serious look, but I wouldn't say no. Oh no. That would be the scariest looking coon ever. I do not want to see a coon or a raccoon. I mean a raccoon. Why am I saying coon? I don't want to see a raccoon with Jay-Z lips. That's scary. To just <laughs> so I did more research. Wait, maybe. Oh, okay. I'm yeah. black person. <laughs> still, I didn't fully understand because most of the people calling me a coon were also black. <laughs> so I delved deeper into the internet. Or in other words, I used Urban Dictionary. I then read. Yeah. What it said. A coon is a person of African descent whose sole purpose is to entertain white people. These <laughs> coons started out as wearing blackface, characterized by having big eyes and painting big red lips on their face. These Dang. people would tap dance, play instruments, and sing. Modern day coons are black who play <laughs> stereotypical roles and black entertainers that promote ignorance. Wow. And then, I mean, okay, so I didn't know all that. I just thought it was an offensive name to uh, black people. I, I mean, well, that's Urban Dictionary for you. But it's like, no, I just look, okay, because, yeah, when they, when hit a Minnesota boy, he was calling me a coon and stuff. I was in it, and then that's what they're saying, like, to entertain a, a white audience. I entertain people all over, okay? Whether they're, you know, white, black, uh, Asian, Mexican, um blue yellow orange like neon blue i mean <laughs> it's just i don't care what color or race you are i'm here to entertain you so moving on i'm a coon and then i thought about all the other people that fit the criteria <laughs> and then i realized there are coons all around us Chris Rock, coon. Uh -oh. Eddie Murphy, coon. Dang. Dave Chappelle, coon. Kevin Hart, coon. Dang. Jimmy Fox, coon. Bill Cosby, coon. Uh, well, <laughs> oh, no, that nigga just fucked up. Really. <laughs> <laughs> Black people have been cooning for years. Black people have been dabbing. Dabbing. <laughs> Millie rocking. I researched more and found out that there is a, a song called Watch oh, Me this guy. by a guy called Silento. I can't remember who he is. Now, this no the reason why the reason why I don't like that song is because you know there we always have those hip moms that really just they they want to get involved with my generation of music and then they find songs like that and then they blow it up and then they sing it all around the house it's songs like that man that just makes me like, I wish I had hair that I could just grow out on the side so I could just pull it out just for songs. Just, it's it's not normal. Black. Ladies and gentlemen, he is black. <laughs> Silento has been teaching black it people like how to Bowl. dance for months. And over 800 million Dang. people had seen the video. And this wasn't the first. Fuse ODG. Made the song. I know people are gonna be all like, now nah, I know people are they're gonna be all like, you know, did you dislike? I do not dislike videos on YouTube. I if I don't like them, I will not go to them. All right, so just let you guys know that right oh, now. Boy, we've cranked that. Black people have been singing and dancing for years. <laughs> we've been cooning 
Uh oh. Uh oh. No, just chill, bruh. Hey, that tank hat, though, with the green. I like that. That's actually pretty. <laughs> but I was. Don't you do it! Don't you do it! Don't dab! Don't dab, man! Don't you do it! KSI, man, come on! No, don't, please don't! No, don't do it! Imagine, imagine walking in his room, okay? You're trying to figure out what is going on, and you just walk in, peek your head through the door. You see him at this stage, like, shaking his head, losing his mind, and it's just, okay, I'm going out to get me something to eat and some Red Bull or something, because I'm kind of scared right now. Uh-oh. He down. <laughs> Don't cry about it. Oh, my <laughs> <laughs> Why that's such the like saddest thing ever, man. Modern day dancing, but it's just so sad. Well, my people coons. thanks for watching. Peace. That was actually Oh, the African mom. The, uh, but yeah, it's just, you know, it's the whole name Coon and stuff. Like, I don't really, all, I don't believe in all of them, like, racist, derogatory names. I mean, it's, yes, names are going to be said, but I, it just doesn't have an effect on me. Like, if I hear people saying, like, the N-word or Coon or, like, I know, because the reason why, the reason why I see it as all jokes and I don't really get offended by it, me and my friend, which was black, all right, just let you guys know, he was a black guy too. We would just go to school and call each other racist names just for the fun of it. He first day I ever met him, he walked up to me and he called me a coon. So I'm thinking to myself, what what is he why why he called me a coon? Like what what is he calling me a coon for? Him seeing my reaction to it cuz I'm like I'm looking at him like what what was the reason behind behind that? And he just started laughing. After that, we were just we became friends. We were calling each other racist names. He was cracking up laughing in class one day. I called him a porch monkey. We laugh about that stuff. I don't when so when his fans are calling me, well yeah, when Minnesota boy his fans was calling me that name and everything else. I just laughed about it. I know you guys are probably all like, you know, why did you bring up Minnesota? That's the only, I say that's the only person that's called me a coon more than everybody, all right? So it's just, it's it's like, I don't really see stuff. And besides, even like what my, like what my mom, I jokingly, because I'm close with my mom, I jokingly would go around and call her. <laughs> it's, I know you guys are all like, you and your mom have a, the craziest, you know, relationship to where it's you guys. I can call my mom a porch monkey and she would just start cracking up laughing about it, okay? Don't know why. It's the one would think, you know, my kids, like mostly, you know, black kids, you call your mom a porch monkey, you're getting slapped upside the head. But me, on the other hand, I just... I don't know. I just, it's, I just, we, we call each other those type of names. We just laugh about it. And it's, it's not, because we don't really see it as an offensive thing. Maybe when another, I guess if somebody else were to call us that, then it just be looking at them like, okay, and is, are, is, am I supposed to care now or am I supposed to care later? I don't care. <laughs> it's like, it's, I don't care. Okay. So it's just go ahead, call me a racist name. It's not going to matter to me. All right. But anyways, this video KSI, man, that was like, that scene was so epic, though, him trying not to dab, and then, and then you got Migos, because yeah, I think it was Migos that was uh, singing that song, the dab or something, and uh, he was trying so hard not to dab and things, and so... I, it's like, I apologize, you know, what What am I apologizing for? I, I, I apologize, or I guess I apologize for laughing at his sadness. He's trying not to dab, but I'm laughing at him, and then also trying to just be serious, telling him don't do it, but 
It's just it's stuff that we just end up dealing with. But anyway, everybody, go subscribe to KSI for more videos like this. He uh, he has 12,598,000 subscribers. So yes, he is putting in work on YouTube. And I want you guys, if you can subscribe to me, you can subscribe to him too. So with that being said, people, thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And if you are new, please like and subscribe and peace.